This is Fiba Podcast. Thank you for joining us in our morning daily devotion. Good morning. We continue looking at biblical prayer patterns and today we look at the life of Jacob. In Genesis 32:25, we read, "When the man saw that he had not prevailed against him, he touched the socket of Jacob's hip, and the socket of Jacob's hip was dislocated while he wrestled with him." The angel touched Jacob's thigh. In ancient Israel, the thigh represented strength and power. It was a symbol of procreative power too. In Genesis 24:9, we see how Abraham tells his servant to put his hand under his thigh to ensure that he will keep the oath made to his master. In Numbers 5:21 and 22, we see that the thigh is used as a description an euphemism for a woman's ability to bear and conceive children that night jacob the deceiver the schemer learned some rich lessons when the sun rose the next day he walked with a different gait jacob the deceiver became israel the inheritor jacob the loser became israel the victor He knew that he had received God's blessing. He understood that his blessing was not only for himself but for the generations to come. He learned that battles are never won by his own strategies or strength. Neither was it his procreative power to multiply and greatly increase. The dislocation of his thigh was a daily reminder that victory could come only through God's power and never by human endeavor that one touch from the lord had eternal implications in the line of jacob's descendants would come forth one of whom was foretold in genesis 49:10 the scepter shall not depart from judah nor a lawgiver from between his feet until Shiloh come and unto him shall be the gathering of the people dear friend have you like jacob tried to strive and do things in your own strength have you been running away from god and from your brother because of humiliation and offense it is time to stop running friend it is time for you to have that god encounter as you bend the knee and humble yourself God promises forgiveness and victory. God will begin to restore your relationships. Every wrong decision, every evil scheme or distant relationship can be made right. All it takes is an intentional decision on your part for course correction. You may come out of your prayer closet walking with a limp. but it will be a limp of victory it will be a limp toward your god given destiny don't settle for less don't compromise don't be complacent that wrestling match at the ford of jabok a long long time ago changed the trajectory of jacob's life that same god the god of jacob is waiting for you today so come to him Let us pray. Father God, we thank you that you understand us better than we know ourselves. We thank you, Lord, like Jacob, you are willing to give us a new name, a new identity, provided we are willing, Lord, to face who we are on the inside. Father, remove every mask, remove every bit of independence and self-reliance. lead us to our god-given destinies and help us lord to change the trajectory of our lives to impact your kingdom work in jesus name amen dear listener we are here to stand with you in your time of need we want to pray with you and for your prayer request do you need someone to talk to we are here for you call us or send a message at +91 Six three six four two five two one six four plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four. God bless you.